<laughs> You're laying on my foot. <laughs> So if you actually scraped away at some of this, it would look kind of like that, white. But this is actually algae on top, which makes it that color. And most people get that confused and think it's volcanic because we are on top of a dormant volcano. Oh, oh right. I you guys have scored. Yeah, I don't know about all that. <laughs> okay, well. That direction there, we have a place called Wrecking Hill. Now, it's called Wrecking Hill for a very simple reason. We used to have a lot of people sit up there, a lot of pirates back in the day. They used to get drunk, sit up rum, set up bonfires. And what that would do was it would attract ships. Now as our reef system is, a lot of people back in the day wouldn't have known where the channel was. So when they came into Wreck Hill, there's a lot of reefs there that will mash up their ships. The ships will get caught on a reef. Now our guys will go out there, our native Bermudian pirates will go out to them, say to them, listen, we'll take 80% of your cargo, and we'll help to fix you up, get you out of here right now. Of course, being ignorant as they were, people were saying no. The captain's like, no, we, we we're fine, we'll get ourselves fixed on this. Come morning time, they realize what a predicament they're actually in, and the fact that they cannot get out without a hand, they come looking for us. Now, after all this drinking, everyone's run out of food and their rum, all of our pirates, we need to restock. They come back to us, they say, you know what, we'll take a deal. 80% of our cargo, fix us up, we'll get out of, uh, get out of, your, get out of your hair, as the English teacher say. Alright? Now, because the pirates, they're empty, they've lost all possessions, they've drunk themselves away. They say, no, we want 100% of your cargo. We're not taking 80% of your cargo. That was a done deal if you said it last night. You said, no, we want 100% cargo. So, of course, having no other option, the captain will have to do that, otherwise, he will remain stuck in Bermuda. So, they'll take it, fix up their boats, 100% of your cargo is ours, thank you very much, have a nice sail home. Now the Queen started hearing about this, as you know we are a British owned colony. The Queen started hearing about this and said, you know what, I'm going to make it legal for you guys to do this, but on a certain, there's a, there's a certain catch to it. Anything that is British owned, any boat that has a crown on it, representing the Queen, you guys cannot touch. If they ask for your help, you give it to them. There's no taking of cargoes. Okay? So all of us were like, sure, you've now made it legal for us to take all your stuff. Wicked. 
We're not going to complain about that. A lot of ships from then on kept coming in. Same thing would happen. We'll take all your cargo. We'll wait for you guys to realize how much you're going to predict when you are in. And then once you realize you're in that predicament, you ask for our help, we're going to take everything you learn on that ship. Now, over the years, all of this became a little bit less subtle. Laws started changing. So we weren't allowed to steal from you guys. So now what we call it today, <laughs> come and give to us. We don't take no more. You give to us. So you know your stuff in that shed. Welcome to Bermuda. <laughs> <laughs> so if anyone wants to be my uh, my uh, captain, wants to take this lead and go all the way back down there and look for your stuff, if you guys don't have an English passport or any sort like that, it's all gone. Thank you very much. Like I said, welcome to Bermuda. We're happy. We're going to go get a lot of rum tonight from that. Alright, so a little history lesson on why we pirates are now called tourism. And why we can't steal no more and why we're not pirates. We can't legally do it. Alright, now from here. We're gonna go for a simple little route. We're gonna go through there. We're gonna see some mangrove trees. We're gonna ask you a little question on mangroves, see if any of you guys can have the answer for me. Then we're gonna go look for some turtles. I'm gonna, like I said, try catching a turtle. We're all gonna take a nice little roam around there. When we come back through, we're gonna go to a nice little house around here. And from there, we're gonna go back down. The first island we visited, there was that beach behind us. We're gonna go there, there's a deep pool there. We're gonna have a nice little swim. We're gonna have a nice talk, conversate between all of us, get to know each other. Like I said, ask about my personal life, I will tell you, it's not a problem. Then we're gonna head back in, all right? What's the stuff they're burning? That's probably a, uh, it's, 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 probably it's just, a just a bonfire. If it's not, someone house. It and we don't want it to be no one's house, so I think it's a bonfire. I'm, I'm gonna say bonfire. We have it every so often, you see it sometimes. Sometimes it's not burning, sometimes it does. That is how much they got. 